Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from New Orleans Recipes of 1949, we're gonna be making the ham and horseradish sandwich. We'll start things off with some mayonnaise, horseradish, and chopped ham. Give that a big old mix. Then we place that between two slices of bread. Make sure you get it all over the place. That really helps the flavor. Then we put it in the toaster to brown. Okay, let's give this ham and horseradish sandwich a go. It's interesting that they have you mix in mayonnaise with the horseradish and then put it in the oven, but it's not bad. I do think we can plus it up a little. I'm gonna add a little bit of uh, chopped chives. Actually, a lot of chopped chives. Tomato, salt, pepper, a little bit of lettuce. Okay, let's give this plussed up ham and horseradish sandwich a go. That definitely elevated it. The chive plays really nicely with the horseradish, of course, with the mayonnaise and the ham. And the lettuce and tomato are just bringing a nice freshness to it as well. This is quite good now. Okay, so the original ham and horseradish sandwich did have a nice little uh, bite of horseradish. Uh, the toast was a nice uh, move as well. So I'm gonna give that a six. It's not a great sandwich, but it's not bad. Uh, adding in chives and then tomato and lettuce, that's a seven and a half, eight. That is really good. I would make that again. And I'm definitely gonna finish this one. So, all right, <laughs> see you tomorrow. We're gonna be making the ham and horseradish sandwich. You'll never guess what's in it. See you tomorrow. When we'll do another sandwich.